Hello, welcome to the first lesson of our unit zero. Now, this is a video lesson overview, how these video lessons kind of work. Now, the point of these video lessons is that they're short. They should be less than 10 minutes so that you don't get bored and I don't just drag on and on and on. So let's keep going. They're focused. We pick one thing to really focus in on learning about and understanding. And they're repeatable. You can pause it, rewind it, watch it again you can get the information however you need to get it. Now, video lessons are great because of these things make it so easy for you to really focus on learning what we need to learn. However, They aren't magic. Uh, that's a clip from The Matrix if you are familiar with it. Now it's an older movie for you guys. But we can't just download information into your brains. You have to actually put work in to understand. So, the best practices. How can you be the CEO of video learning? You need to take notes. Now, I provide guided notes, which you should currently have. If you don't have them, go figure that out. Pause the video. What are you doing? You should have guided notes. Now, they have some of the words missing. They might have some of the statements missing. And you're filling it out along because research shows that helps everyone's brain better understand what you're learning. The writing process helps your brain entrain the new information. You should be focused. Your eyes, ears, and mind are all on the video. If you're listening, I guess, but you're watching something else, you're not going to take the information in. right? If you're looking at it, but you're listening to tunes instead of my voice, you're not going to get it into your head. And if you're thinking about a game or a friend or something else, if you're talking to somebody while you're looking at it, you're not going to get it all. Pause to write, think, or rewind when you need to. Right? If I give you a lot to write in the notes and I'm talking and you can't do both, just pause it for a second, write it down, and then go back to it. The materials you're going to need. You're going to need a Chromebook probably if you're in class. Those are in the Chromebook cart. You're probably going to want headphones. These videos should have captions you can use, um, but usually it's better if you can hear what I'm saying. And it's better if you use headphones to do that. And last, like I said, the guided notes and a pen or pencil to fill them out. 